The Jade Buddha Monastery at Anyuan Road, Shanghai, was built in 1882. It has a history of over 120 years with good attendance. Life here appears to be the same as those of traditional monasteries. But the truth is, after prayer and breakfast time every morning, this school bus that waits outside the refectory reveals the new face of the monastery. These monks have been selected by the monastery leadership to study degree courses. Every morning from Monday to Friday, they have to leave the world of the Buddha for a moment and attend classes at the Shanghai International Studies University. They have never been late. As the monks have special requirements for their meals, they return to the refectory in the monastery for lunch. In this refectory, more than ten workers are hired to prepare the three meals for the monks every day. The monks always have their meals with male and female visitors and hired workers. The television is on. The monks watch news report while having their meals. It's a huge difference from the traditional conservative cloistered monastery life, and manifests a new monastery management philosophy. Prior to the foreign language training, some monks were selected in 2005 to study MBA in Shanghai Jiao Tong University. At that time, many people couldn't understand. They worried that the complicated society would lose the last piece of Pure Land if the monks were sent to study marketing. Well, we also met different voices, but we met with the leaders of the monastery, through the research we did, and we met with the right people. We met with the right people, and we met with the right people. 只要是对的，吃得住的，我们还是坚坚决的住。呃，有些议论，有些看法，那么我们想呢，等到若干年以后，让历史啊，让世人来证明，我们这一步跨出去到底是对还是不对。作为一个法师，一个弘法者，如果说你跟社会脱节了，那么你怎么能弘法？怎么能弘佛法？
afternoon, more and more visitors come to the monastery. They worship and pray. No matter the past or present, Chinese people feel the need to pray for blessings, console the dead, and express their faith. Monks in their robes are considered as the bridge between man and Buddha. When the monks are getting involved with secular life, what do the believers think? This Sunday, the monks are coming to the most popular bookshop in downtown area to buy their books. Everyone is getting something. On their way back to the monastery, they are feeling good when they walk through the city that is both familiar and strange to them. The New Year is approaching. An annual New Year celebration will be held in the monastery. Members of the Buddhist musical group are busy with their rehearsal. Uh, 